Hey everyone, I'm doing something new today. I'm playing a new game called Wuthering Waves. I know I don't do this often, but this game has really piqued my interest, so I thought I'd give it a try. It just came out like a few days ago, and everyone's been talking about it, and it's very similar to Genshin, I've heard. Well, I've seen actually a little bit, and that makes me excited because I love Genshin, and having more games like that is just a win. So now I don't know that much about this game. Like, I mean, I've seen a few trailers and stuff, but like I tried to avoid as much like content from the game as I could because I didn't want to like spoil the experience for myself. I I'm very big on having like the best experience possible when it comes to new things. I mean, I have heard of a few bad things about this, about like, like optimization issues and like some story issues possibly, but I'm going to take everything with a grain of salt because people are overly negative these days, so it could not be nearly as bad as they're saying. I'll have to see for myself. And now, first things first, I'd like to say this background music is so good. I love it. It's it's so, like, melancholic. It's it's intense. It's sad. And I, I love that. It, it sets the vibe for the whole rest of the game, as I know it's supposed to be it's set in a post-apocalyptic world. This menu music definitely fits that vibe. And I, I love stuff like that. I love, well, dark worlds. I'm a big fan of Dark Souls, if you've seen my other videos. So with that all said, let's just get right into it. All right. Here we go. I'm excited. It's been a long time since I've played a new game. It's not something I do very often. So let's let's get into this. Oh, who's this? That's a cool design. Lesson one, CPR. Ugh. Wow, the character animations are cool. Are really good. Wait, hold on. She doesn't speak. Are you serious? <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so I've already noticed that. Yeah, the main character does not speak. I was hoping that's something that would never come up in any other game because that kind of sucks in Genshin, not gonna lie. I know it's just the very beginning, but still, that doesn't look very promising, at least for now. We'll see, we'll see though. Your attire doesn't seem local. Are you a roving traveler from afar or someone returning home? Okay, okay, I shouldn't be comparing this game to Genshin so much, but how can I not? They literally say the exact same thing. They even say traveler. <laughs> it's a little, it's a little too on the nose. Baisha didn't tell us you'd have these after effects when you wake up. Oh, so we were expected. Oh, another thing that I heard about this game is that it just like throws you into the deep with like new terminology and lore. And I heard people said that they were quite overwhelmed by that. So that's just something to keep in mind for me. All right, here we go. Now I get full control. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, okay. We have resonators who can detect the formation of tacit fields nearby. Okay, so, okay. Yeah, I guess I'll just compare this game to Genshin on literally everything. <laughs> resonators sounds exactly like vision wielders. And I don't know if you just saw that. <laughs> that lag, that was, that was kind of bad. Okay. The, oh my gosh. Yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty laggy. So the controls are the same as Genshin. I'm using, I'm using the exact same stuff. Oh, you jump a lot higher though. Let's look at the map. All right, cool. I like the, I like the style. The map looks cool. No, uh, look at that. We got exploration percentage. Yeah, I'm the kind of person who likes to go or who likes to go 100% everywhere. I might be in for a long grind again. <laughs> oh, okay. I can I can I can attack already. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. All right, I'm just sitting here. I, I should keep, I should get going. But you never know when a tacit discord might pop up out of nowhere. Oh my, speak of the devil. Oh, all right. First, okay. Well, I'm not up there. First combat encounter. Let's see how it feels. Ha. Ha. Oh, what's the skill do? Is it slash? Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool. Ha. Oh, well, I suck. No. Oh, I'm totally ruining my stamina. <laughs> okay, the combat... Okay, there's no double jump. Oh, was that a dodge? <laughs> there's no double jump. I kind of was expecting that to be that. <laughs> oh, wow. It's a whole dragon. Okay, so that was a... Like a charge attack, but then you can have like a... A plunging by just jumping straight up. I like that. I like that feature. Aerial combat, at least somewhat like that, is really fun. There is one capital and six cities in Huanglong, with each city having its own sentinel. Hey, is that like the seven nations and their archons? Seems a little, once again, seems a little on the nose. There are sentinels in other regions too, but fewer compared to Huanglong. Oh, okay, so they're not exactly like archons. Oh, look at these guys. 
Oh, is this, uh, what's this? Okay, that was... Okay, <laughs> that was an ultimate. Oh, that guy is huge. <laughs> oh, okay. Now I can, I can... I get hit right away. Alright. Oh, we got a quick time event. Swaps. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, that was fun. That was cool. Okay, you can do it a lot. Oh. I suck. <laughs> oh, wait. You know what? I can just do this. I was not dead. There we go. So I've been playing a lot of Honkai Impact, so I'm used to there being like a flash of light before each time they do like a big a, a hit. That is an indicator for dodging. <laughs> I was expecting to see that and then there wasn't one. I just kept getting hit. I'm like, oh, whoops. <laughs> okay, so like, I'm supposed to go over there, but like, what's up here? Oh my gosh, you can just run up ladders. <laughs> I can just like mantle up everything. That's, that makes, where am I? Is that a, is that a chest? <laughs> a box or something? Yep, it sure is. First chest. Cherish every game. So she does have a voice. <laughs> okay. Oh, the character screen. The animations in the menus, like the, the UI is really smooth. Oh, I just zoomed out. Look at the map. This is, okay, it looks pretty big. <laughs> oh, keep going. Wow. Wait, this is a big area with nothing. <laughs> well, I'm excited to see what it all looks like. Okay, so this must be a teleport waypoint. Yep, it sure is. Yep, that's what it is. Okay. <laughs> there will be a descent, but if your terminal's glider module still works... Oh, the glider. Yeah. Wow. Look at this. The tacit discords born within are usually stronger. Okay, yeah. I can't, I can't see that rest of the dialogue. I heard that that was a complaint as well. Now it's time to use the glider module. Rover, let me help you activate it. Okay, so listening to this, the voice actor for um, Yang Yang, she doesn't sound like she's a native English speaker. Is it just me? That just that sounds weird. Like her her pronunciations of many words don't sound like a native English speaker. Anyways, glider time. I can't look. <laughs> I can't look down. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, I remember seeing this from the beta. Well, I didn't play the beta. Like, I saw some clips. Yeah, I saw this. I saw this guy. Alright, first full-on boss fight. Right at the start. Okay. I- I totally missed. I totally missed. You, you know what? You're not attacking me either. What if we just, like, stand here and look at each other? <laughs> Fine, I'll attack you. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Oh, yes. I'm so happy we have a camera lock. Let me do I'm out of stamina. Ooh. I didn't see her ult, that was cool. Oh, this is really fun, this is really fun. I'm liking this combat system a lot so far. Ooh, second phase? Ooh, I was not supposed to- okay. <laughs> okay, it's flashy but also has room for skill expression, that's cool. Nice. Oh, okay. Well. Okay, that was not second phase. This is second phase. <laughs> okay. Oh, you can do a counter attack. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna have to get used to that. That's not something I'm used to doing. Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> I didn't read that in time. Hold on. Let me read this. Oh, that just, that did not go well at all. Man, I'm second, I'm second. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Yo, what is that? Oh, that was cool. I, okay, I don't, there we go, okay. I kind of prefer dodging though. Okay, it's like a stagger and then you have like a finishing move. That's cool. That was cool. That was really cool. Yeah, yeah, when he died, he like kind of froze there. I am Jin Shi, the magistrate of Jinjo. Oh, she's the uh, the leader, <laughs> the, the highest ranking official. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got to be important. Nice. 
Nice. Okay. I want to be able to get that counter attack system down. I suck. I suck. I suck. Oh gosh. <laughs> well, I want to be able to do this counter attack. Alright. Well, okay. At least I have to hit it. <laughs> oh, okay. Interesting. This is definitely unique. One with the sounds. Yeah. That's really interesting. Alright, what is this? I don't know what that is, but I picked it up. What in the heck is that thing? I'm going to- well, I'm gonna go up to that thing. <laughs> it's an enemy. Alright, alright. Oh, I did a counterattack on accident. <laughs> Wait, is this like artifacts? Actually, I think it is because this is like talents. This is constellations. Okay, it's not unique. <laughs> okay, the ability thing is unique though. Well, okay, I guess I'll just continue following the main story because it's just going to take me to the city anyways. You know, I gotta say, the world is like really pretty and I love the ambience they have in this game. Oh, here we are. We're at the city now. Wow, look at that. Act 1 complete. Oh, there's someone up there. <laughs> There you are. Whoa. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you? Whoa. Oh, is that like... <laughs> is that like the Statue of the Seven? Oh, the city is cool looking. It's like a futuristic China. Wow, this is so cool. Oh, we get her. Alright, cool. You know, she kind of, she, I didn't say this earlier, but she definitely reminds me of Yoimiya a little bit. Like, she's so, like, upbeat and carefree. She's fire as well, <laughs> so. Yeah, here she is. Let's see, let's see what she does. Oh, she has guns. Oh. Ooh, those sounds are really cool. They, they're really punchy. I like it. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I wonder if that can, like, you can keep going with that. I don't know what this means, but there's like, so I guess there's some sort of progression system with each echo. Oh, oh, that's cool. So over time, you can increase your max stamina. I like that. Wait, I'm stupid. Stamina. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't. Okay. Okay. I, I was thinking stamina was like resin, like your daily stamina, you know, gotcha game stuff. But no, no, no. This is climbing and combat stamina. <laughs> oh, yeah. Awesome. They have a, a cutscene archive. That's cool. That's good. That's I, I love that because Genshin doesn't have that. I'm I'm glad that this game does. I have like a, a bunch of ra wait. These are healing items. Hold on. Wait, these are healing items. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. That's good to know. Okay. <laughs> Pioneers Association. This is the Adventurers Guild. Yep. That's what this is. Oh, oh, okay, so this is... Oh, cool, it's all right here. Hey, it's a dog. Wait, okay, hold on. Don't tell me. Can I, can I... Yes, I can pet the dog. This is all I've ever wanted. <laughs> yes, oh, I can feed it. I don't have anything to feed you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wow, look at this huge square, or circle, or whatever shape this is. Nexus Tower, I'm guessing Statue of the Seven equivalent. Exactly. Did she answer my it's question? <laughs> I'm kidding. Whoa. Oh, not the direction I was thinking it was gonna go. I wonder where the... the... is the... oh, this is the one? Okay, for this area. It's, it's gonna bug me so much to have this middle area not, not activated. Oh, this is cool. They even have a seating area out here. I love the attention to detail that all of the environment has. Can I cook? I sure can cook. I don't have anything to cook, though. <laughs> oh, you need recipes. Okay. That, well, yeah, that makes sense. There's a cat! Yes, I can't interact with the cat. No, why? <laughs> Let me pet you. Or maybe it's because it's too focused on the fish. That's probably why. Oh, here's another cat. No, I can't interact with the cat. Why can I only pet dogs and not cats? No. <laughs> it's not that big of a deal, but like, why have one when you can't do the other? That seems a bit odd. I got a weapon. I got a new weapon. And that is ever so slightly better. <laughs> okay, so I'm guessing this is common. This is like, uncommon? I don't know. It's just, it's green. <laughs> it's just green. <laughs> I'll switch to that. Ooh, what is this building? 
I don't know what this is, but it's cool looking. It seems like I'm in some sort of like laboratory because there's a whole bunch of people in like lab coats and such. What is in this room? There's a whole car in here. <laughs> what? Wait, I took damage from that. <laughs> oh. Yes, I can interact with cats too. Okay, okay. I was forgiven. I'm sorry I ever doubted you, Weathering Waves. Well, okay. Maybe not every cat. <laughs> so, long story short, these are oculi. Oh my gosh. It's in the robot. Okay, I think I think he likes it. Wait, I'm not running out of stamina? Oh, it doesn't drain. Oh, that's nice. It only drains when dodging. Wow, look at this little sh or little I say. Look at this shrine over here. That's cool looking. Anyways, wait a second. Hold on. What do I see in there? Wow. Okay. Why didn't I notice this? There's a whole huge city underneath the thing up there. Oh my god. This is this is, this place is huge. Wow. Look at this. Wow, this is so pretty. Wow, this place is huge. Yeah, look at this grand building. It's called a domain. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow, look at the world. There's a whole bunch of buildings over there. It is really pretty. Oh, I bet the view from up here is incredible. Yeah, it's even better than down there. Oh, wow, yeah, look at all that. That's cool. Ooh. Wow, this is what a pretty building. Man, that's one thing they know how to do. They definitely did all these building designs really well. Please follow me. She's British. Oh, now that I see this right here, I wonder if the if each rover is part of the story or if just once you pick one, the other one just ceases to exist. Because it didn't look like the other one was anywhere to be found. It could just be the same character but gender swapped. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is the same game. Oh my gosh, we have the same black box to explain different things off screen. That's, yeah, this, this is, this is the same game. They, they made this game a little too similar to Genshin. Oh, okay. All right, it's time to use the grapple. See? Just open the utility. See? Oh, okay. That's how the grapple works. Can it be used anywhere? If you want to be a hero like the Jinjo Speedster, you gotta master the grapple. You, you can, can use it anywhere. That's cool. Okay, so it's like both. There's grapple points, and then you can just use it anywhere. Whoa! What an interesting looking area. Oh, I get, I get, um, right. Yeah. What does he do? Oh. What the heck? Oh, she's a summoner. Oh, I see. Interesting. Wow. Such a well, that was bad. <laughs> oh, okay. I was trying to see what it would do. <laughs> An oversight. Gosh. Okay, let's actually like... Whoa. Wait, can I do this in combat? Oh, I can! Oh, you got a level 18, wow. Rejuvenating snow. Ooh. I don't know what that did. <laughs> Commence healing. Let me be your blade. Precipitant synchronization. We have gathered all the data. Okay. <laughs> crazy, those abilities are very crazy. Oh. What? Hello? Oh, that was weird. I'm Whoa. Back to the same spot again. And this moon. What is happening? Okay, so the rover does talk. Okay. Whoa, what is that? Tacit discords. Seems like one big one. Am I gonna have to fight it? Probably. Oh, look at this thing. Oh, looks like a person.
Okay, here we go. Oh, Clover. no? Oh, okay, okay. We're not fighting. Okay. <laughs> I was looking forward to fighting it. <laughs> oh. oh, that's that's gotcha. There we go. I finally unlocked it. Let's let's take a look at it. So looks like this is the standard banner. And this is the standard weapon banner. And this is the beginner banner. And then our current limited banner. Oh, I can look at all the characters. Look at her. She's adorable. And then Tianxin. I've seen a lot of people really excited about her. And yeah, I, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> this guy, Ling Yan. I remember um, he had a design change before he was anthropomorphic, I think is the word. But now he's a human with animal ears. <laughs> I guess people didn't like that. Okay, and Verena. This is who I want. She's super cute. And my favorite character in Genshin is Nahida. And I think you can... If, if you know, I think you could probably guess why I'd want her. <laughs> and then we have this guy. Uh, Calchado. Calcharo. Calcharo. He's not my not my thing. <laughs> cool design, though. I mean, they're, they're all really well designed. I, I can... I really appreciate how much detail they put into every single one of them all right yeah i think i'll i'll go i'll spend all of these right now might as well might as well and it's 20 percent off so it's eight for a tenfold that's normal <laughs> just like engine <laughs> all right so 50 is guaranteed a five star but it could come earlier than that but well m we'll see i'm just yeah let's just go oh what's the animation okay that is really epic <laughs> Woohoo, I got a little three-star weapon. <laughs> yeah, I think that's going to be a recurring theme. Just like Genshin. I don't know what any of these are. I'm sure I'll know what these are eventually. Oh, it's a weapon. Eh, oh well. Alright, that, yeah, that was my first pull in the Wuthering Waves. Alright, let's keep going. And it's purple again, which, yeah, that's four-star. <laughs> it's really punchy, the sound that it makes when you when a new item appears. I like it. Oh. What does our loyal client wish to inquire about today? Oh, that's cool. I didn't Okay, I forgot about this. I knew that characters got animations for their introductions, but I, I just I forgot. I forgot. I didn't also I didn't think it'd be for four stars as well. So I, I got a character. Um Alto. It has two A's. I don't know how I'm supposed to pronounce it, but I'll I'll just say Alto for now. That's awesome. My first character. Well, my first new gotcha character besides the three starters it's four star again discord oh i think that's a broad blade so that means i don't have a character that can use it yet that's unfortunate four star again all right we're going to quote unquote hard pity <laughs> oh i got it again oh this this is this is the one this is the guaranteed one right i think so i think it is all right let's do it Let's see which 5 star I get. Yep, there it is. There's 5 star. So that's what it looks like. Alright, let's see. Let's see. I am Ooh. A I sh at the oh, she right. She's a 4 star. <laughs> what are the odds I get a character that I already know? That's cool. Oh man, I'm kind of nervous. I wonder who I get. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I got the guy that I didn't care about. <laughs> okay he's the one i didn't want <laughs> or he's the one out of the five that i wanted the least i mean it's it's okay it's fine <laughs> i'm sure he's really cool anyways since he's a five star and i'll i'll still use him and i can i can pick who i want after anyways but yeah there we go okay you know what his abilities are awesome <laughs> Like, okay, I was disappointed to get him, but, like, he seems fun. Alright, so I've, I've been playing a long time. I think to, it's a good time to wrap up my first playing session of this game. So this game, Weathering Waves, it's it's very interesting. So I like I like the art style a lot. It looks really nice. The I love the design of all the buildings and the environment itself. The character designs are really nice, too. And for sure, my favorite thing so far has been the combat. Oh my gosh, the, the combat is so much fun. It is, it, it's just like, it's great. I love it. I love it. And I can't wait to fight more things. Honestly, I wish I had more things to fight in this so far. I wish I had, I wish I fought more things today, but 
You know what? I, I know I will in the future, so it's fine. But I will say, this game is way too similar to Genshin. Like, I know the point was to make a game that is what they wanted Genshin to be, but they, like, literally copied almost everything. All of the systems, all of the little things that Genshin does, like, it's all exactly the same. Now, I would get that for Star Rail, Honkai Star Rail, because that's a game made by the same company, but this is not. And still, that game's different because it's a turn-based game. This is, like, almost exactly the same. No, I'm not calling it a rip-off, like, those stupid people that called Genshin a Breath of the Wild rip-off, because it's not, it's different. And even this, I'd say, is probably more similar to Genshin than Genshin is to Breath of the Wild. But they're still their own games. It's obvious that they're not the same game. And yeah, there were some issues with the lag and text box is not letting you scroll down to see the rest of it. And as well as like some of the like, it's a little blurry graphically, like from like, it looks a little rough sometimes. I, I don't know how the best way to describe that, but like, I I'm sure some people know what I mean. But I will say the overall graphical quality is really good and honestly, is superior to Genshin. Like, the lighting looks really good. The texture quality looks really good, and I appreciate that. Also, I like the atmosphere. I like the more muted colors of this game. I like the post-apocalypticness of it. I will say, it's not as much as I expected, but I heard that they changed the game on purpose to suit the Genshin fanbase a bit more, so I can definitely see that. So overall, yeah, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed playing today, and I will definitely be playing more. So I hope you guys stick around for that. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. And I'll see you soon.